Manny. I'm going to show you how to make pinaki. Put aside two pieces off each pile. These are spares in case of breakage. Flip one stack so it mirrors the other and place end to end. The big clips only go in the center overlap. The small clips go in all the other holes. It is important to support the back of the plywood with two fingers. If you don't do this, it might break. Always have the shape nearest you as the one on top. Put a small clip in each of the remaining holes. Put this piece to one side. Repeat this process until you have done this with the first 12 pairs. Make sure the central overlaps are all the same. Count that you have 12 sets. Turn the remaining two piles around so that they mirror the joined strip. Clip on the first piece from the pile nearest you. Use only the first two clips. Do the same with the top piece from the second pile, again using only the first two clips. Now continue this alternating over-under assembly with all the remaining pieces. Again, count that you have 12 sets. Be sure to support the back of the material with two fingers. Notice which way we have stood this up, with the bottom shape on top.
Unscrew the cord grip and turn it the other way around. Slide the cone cap on, but do not tighten. Set the length so that the bulb hangs at the center of the shade. Now tighten the cap. Get an electrician to connect, and please use an energy efficient bulb. Now you can feel proud. This is your made up Hinaki, and this is the box it came from.